In 2007, commercial diver Vasilis Medoyanis was working on an underwater project in a remote gulf in northeastern Greece when he spotted a seahorse. I said to myself, wow, a seahorse, that is amazing. Immediately after that, another one passed by, and then another. And then I saw a great many, and I said to myself, hey, what is going on here? And I thought this was really remarkable. The experienced diver says it's rare to see groups of seahorses massed together like that. Driven by curiosity, he decided to form a team of divers to survey and collect data on them. The divers were enthralled by the seahorses, says team member Kostas Katsioulis. It is a unique phenomenon. Those who dived with us became really enthusiastic after seeing the seahorses, because there is no other feeling like it when you're diving. We have spent many, many hours with it. It's a shy creature. It turns its back on the cameras all the time. On the advice of scientists, Medianis created an artificial habitat for the seahorses in 2015. They took to it well. It was very useful for them because they could latch onto it, lie down and camouflage themselves on the rope. Although seahorses live in waters around Greece, scientists say it's unusual to see a stable and continued presence in this particular area. And even though they're a protected species, they've been ravaged by overfishing throughout the Mediterranean Sea, where the environment is considered hostile for them. There are not enough plants on the seabed for the seahorses to latch onto and hide from their enemies. A 2010 flood tore through Stratoni village, pushing sediment into the sea and onto the seabed, partly destroying the seahorses' habitat. So their presence in the region is considered a fortunate occurrence. Medellanis is attempting to mount an official campaign to protect their habitat. <laughs> Certainly something must be done for their protection, this is certain. We are talking about a very small region. I think just keeping the fishing boats away is something that we can accomplish. He does so knowing he has the full support of all those who have encountered the mythical creatures and fallen completely under their spell. Julie Tabo, VOA News.